I'm telling you, Junior, I cracked it. Cracked what? I finally found a way how we can travel the multiverse. With what, a box? Uh, a lit, a plastic container thing? Well, kinda. You see, this is, you see, I call this the way, the universal gateway. Or as I call it, the, the car, or as I like to call it, my, my future of glory. What do you mean? I built this thing. I built this thing out of a special material that, that came out on the computer one time. And now, now that I, now that I constructed that, that crystal I found that came out of the computer into this, into this tub thing, I, it may be able, I may be able to, it might be able now, it might be able now, it might now, it might be able for us to travel the universe or the multiverse. Okay, what is with the multiverse stuff in this channel? I don't know, but still, come on, it will be fun. It will be the greatest adventure we've ever had. Uh, fine, but I better get something out of this. Oh, you will. All right, ready, Junior? Uh, all right. Whoa, this thing is actually flying. Yeah, why well, wouldn't it? I don't know. It's, I mean, it looks like it's plastic. Well, it's not plastic, Junior. All right, ready, Junior? I guess. Three, two, one. What? What's happening? I don't know. What was that, Cody? Oh, I think we're inside the computer. This is the inside of our computer. It's just the room. Well, we can have more than... Well, we can only film videos in our room. Oh. What is this place? What's on, Junior? Cody, look over there. Why? Holy crap, it's Joss's mom. Junior. Junior, first off, Joss's mom's not actually dead, and what's wrong with you? I wanted to make a joke. Yeah. Why is there a skeleton here? I don't know. Hey, uh, is it alive? Of course it's not alive, it's a skeleton. That's offensive. What? For your information, I am alive. What the? A talking skeleton! That's Sans from Undertale. Wait, if you already knew someone from Sand from Undertale, why would, why were you surprised to see a talking skeleton? I don't know, Sand's been dead for a while. Her. I still rest my case. What brings you to the domain of the almighty of the almighty Marrow? Marrow? Is that your name? Yes, I am Marrow. The king, the lord, the king of this domain, and the in the one who rides within the computer of all existence. You're the one who brings people to our universe. Not particularly. McKay hired me, created and hired me to have the harness, the harness to power of the multiverse. So I, so he can bring characters from other universes to here. You know, for more views and such. He created me, and I follow his every whim. One of the things on your fingers. These are the rings of the of all ten uni multiverses. I mean, universes. No, multiverses. Each ring represents a different multiverse. I thought the multiverse was was meant with multiple universes, but are you saying there's multiple multiverses? That's very confusing. Well, I understand it perfectly. Each ring represents a different multiverse. Now I hold them all. Well, there are a few missing. I roll all. I rule all ten. How many rings are there? Let me think. Oh, oh yeah. One, one million. 
One million rings? Is that many multiverses? Actually, no, not a million. A hundred, yes, a hundred rings. There's one hundred multiverses? Yes. Far beyond our own. There are multiverses out there that no one else knows or what has to know about. What do you mean, has to know? Knowing more to, knowing about multiple you know, learning about the, the thousands of multiverses that lie beyond our own, that could lead to some catastrophic events. Things could happen. Things could not happen. Things can no longer exist. That's why it's my job to defend these rings. Whoa, you must you must be a very busy person. Well, not really. It's mostly boring in this computer. All McKay does is. Tell, tell me to bring a person from my universe, and I bring the person from that universe here. Well, you can bring people from other universes. You have that kind of power. I am the almighty Marrow. I can do anything. Then one of making the most powerful being in our, in our multiverse? Of course it does. You know all these people in this multiverse, in this universe, in your Pacific universe, who tells you they're, mo they're the most powerful ever? Well, well, that's all basically a lie. I am tr no one, no one can reach, no one can, no one can compare to the power that I have. I can literally bring people from other multiverses or other universes, for that matter. I am basically God. Well, not actually. That's sacrilegious. Whoa. So you're the one who. So wow, this is all very cool and surprising. Wait until everyone else hears this. Oh, you can't leave. What? Well, you can't leave with those memories. I have to erase your memories before you leave, because no one can know about this. It's... This is intentionally a forbidden area in the multiverse. What? But we need to get this information out. I need... We need to have this information. Why? For money, greed, and glory? Exactly! This is why I don't come outside the universe. <laughs> Look, no one needs to know of this knowledge. Not even you brats. Junior and Joe, Junior and Cody. Wait, you know our names? Of course I know your names. I... Ugh. God, you guys are idiots. And Cody, you're supposed to be the small one. The smart one. Ah. God, you guys are giving me a migraine. You have a brain? I'm not gonna get mad on that one. Anyway, I have no choice but to erase your memories now. Well, we don't want to have our memories erased. Fine. There is one way you can. There is one way you can. I will let you leave without getting your memories erased. You had to beat me in a battle. A battle? Uh, we're not strong at all. We're kids. I thought you guys had double crew powers. We lost those, remember? Oh. Uh, how can I make this fair? I'll give you any power of your choosing. Then if you win win against a battle against me, I'll give you I'll let you leave with this member with this knowledge. How's that sound? Perfect. Good. Good good good. Now, which power do you want to possess? I want he I want I want how about we have a mixture of all the powers we got over the years. Like I can have mine. Like I can read people's minds and shoot lightning and shoot lasers from my eyes. Yeah, and I'll just like to shape shift or do something. How about I give you electricity? Okay, I'll take it. Okay. It shall happen. There, you have the powers. Well, that was quick. Like I said, I'm all powerful, remember? Now, let the battle begin. You can move that tub thing out of the way. It's a multiversal trample machine. Alright, how are we gonna do this? First, let me get into position. And now, the battle shall commence. But I warn you, I have all the power. Since you're kids, I'll go easy against you. You will. I'll hit you with 100% of my power. How much is your power? Wait, 100? How much? How, how powerful can you go? 
up to infinity. Anyway, what's beyond infinity, to be exact? Anyway, let the battle begin. Risk world.